Hey guys, what's up? I'm alive. Margie, that is childish, my goodness. Do I have everything set up right? Can you hear me? Can you see me? <laughs> it's Blistex time, because now it's always Blistex time. Hey, Julie. Jean, hi. 007, you didn't get to be first. <laughs> hey, Natasha, welcome. Hey, Carol. Thank you. I think I might live. This is the first. <laughs> Margie. <laughs> Thank you, Margie. <laughs> You're so funny. Um, this is the first day I've actually felt better. I still have a cough and my nose is running and, you know, I sound like a mess. But um, I don't feel like going and laying in traffic. I actually went out of the house and drove the car today, which was something else. Haven't done that in a while. Almost forgot how, but the kid had to go to the train station. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Christina. Yeah, I, I think I do. I've got this dry cough, which is totally annoying, and I apologize in advance, but I think it's just from my nose running so much. I know, Margie, catch it, would you? Ah, ha, ha. Hey, Joe. Nikki, how are you feeling, my friend? I know, Carol, right? The last couple days, I wouldn't able, even have been able to walk to the traffic to lie down in it. Hey, weirdo. Oh, thanks, Natasha. I love them. They make me happy. You're knackered. Oh, Nikki. Hey, Michelle, welcome. And Vicky, hi there. I'm going to, once again, if I missed a comment or if you've um, asked me a question or something in the last like eight days, if I missed it, I'm so sorry. And I'm not even going to say I'm going to try to go back at this point. Oh, thanks for watching the, the commercial, Susan. Hey, I'm up to like, I don't know, 38 pennies or something. It's awesome. Hey, Sandra. Hey, Babsy. Nan, why aren't you at work? Have you staged an uprising? Have you run away? Ah, uh, thanks, Sandra. Yeah, still sniffling and, as I said, a dry cough, but I missed you guys, and I've gotten some really cool stuff in the mail, I assume. I haven't opened it yet, but I was going to share it with you, and I had all the best plans of having the May stickers out last week, and we see how that went, didn't we? <coughs> thanks, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dry cough. Annoying. Laura, hi, puppy. Yep, definitely on the upswing, Natasha. Thank you. I have committed to laying low all week, though. I'm not going to go crazy and like do spring cleaning and gardening like I want to. I put the special, um, I put the special commercials in the middle of the videos for you, Christina. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. I have my giant glass of water here, so hopefully that will help. Margie, do you say I need to be committed? That's kind of personal, isn't it? <laughs> nice, Natasha. Christina, how are the hothouse tomatoes coming along? I'm quite excited. Oh, look at all the lovey hearts. You guys are so cute. <coughs> not yet. Okay, I am committed about not overdoing it because I do not want to go backwards on this one. My fingers are crossed for you, Natasha. I think we're still going to put in our giant garden, even though we're going to be gone when the good stuff starts producing. <coughs> we will be on the, the road show, but the kids and our friends can come and help. Peppers are good. The tomatoes have 
Perry bugs? What the heck is that, Christina? It sounds terrible. Oh, pesty bugs. Pesty bugs are not good. We had a terrible problem with aphids last year, I think. And Mark actually ended up buying a live, well, a box of live ladybugs and set them free in the garden. It was like 500 of them. It, that's the weirdest thing, let me tell you, to get ladybugs in the mail. Uh, but they went crazy and took care of the whole problem. It was amazing. Tomato bugs are gross and scary, Margie, but tomatoes are so good, it's worth it. Hey, Mindy. Welcome. And hello, my darling fiend. It is a thing, Christina. Ladybugs are the best. And Natasha, you go on Amazon, no lie. You go on Amazon and you buy ladybugs and they ship them to you in the box. And then you have to put them in the refrigerator for a couple days. <coughs> and then you go out and put them in the garden. It's true. I know, isn't it weird? Hey, Busty. I am feeling better. Thank you. And I apologize again for this annoying cough, but there's just nothing I can do. Pretty sure they were ladybugs. Don't those icky Asian beetles um, bite? They're like yellow, right, Margie? Those things bite. I know, Natasha. Mark loves gardening and he loves researching things. And apparently that was the thing to do. It was odd, though, to tell my children not to eat the box of ladybugs that were in the fridge. Yeah, those. They're like yellow or orange and they bite. But they do look a lot like ladybugs. These didn't bite, but sadly, after they did their job, they all went and flew into the pool and drowned. I don't know why. That was their choice. It was sad, though. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to pop on because I miss you. And um, I wanted to let you know I was alive and on the upswing and apologize for being MIA for so long. We knew what you meant, Laura. You silly. It was too, Margie. Oh, good for you, Babsy. You went and got a double scoop of ladybugs, free ladybugs. <laughs> That's funny. I know, Nan. Can you start knitting them little tiny lady life jackets? We'll put them on before we release them this year. Hopefully we won't have aphids again. They were lemming bugs, right, Margie? <laughs> hey, Laura. Laura, I think that you have an order in the shop, a custom order for you that's been there for a while. I was just poking around for the first time in like, again, 10 days out in the inventory. And I think I saw an envelope with your name on it, if you would still like it. It's in the Etsy shop, which is linked in the description down below. And welcome. That was rude. I'm sorry. I'm not positive my brain is functioning all the way yet. So I've gotten so much happy mail. You guys are so more than generous. Oh boy, here comes a sneeze. <coughs> Pardon me. <laughs> oh boy. Sorry, guys. No time to mute. I tried to turn away from the microphone. I forgot too, Laura. If you go check on the order, if you click on it, um, It'll take you into the description. Thanks, guys. <laughs> and this is after Dayquil. Hey, Christy, thank you. Oh, thanks, Laura. Yeah, I really do feel so much better. Natasha, my heart, my shop hearts you too. Oh, hi, honey bunny. I was gonna open up the delicious happy mail that I got from you. This is from Elizabeth, you guys. And I haven't peeked and it's been so hard, but I wanted to share it with everybody. So let me move this stuff. And yes, Laura, Daniel Smith, fancy stuff. I actually went to the art store and well, going out was very exciting, but um, 
these are samples of Daniel Smith paints. It was a pretty good deal. It was $5.39. And hey, Carla. And you can just play with all these different colors to see if you like them. And then I thought, I mean, there's hardly a little smoosh on there. But then I thought when I was done messing around with this, I bet this page will be gorgeous. I will do it, Dorinda, my lovely weirdo. Hey, Jennifer. I am feeling better. Thanks, honey. I know, Darla. I'm afraid. <laughs> Laura's talking to people. People. I can hear you say it. <laughs> so, yeah, I thought we might mess around with these for a minute. I'm afraid, though, Darla, for that very reason. Because of the addictive nature. Are they, Joe? I have some Winsor & Newtons that I really love, um, but at the art store in Portland, um, you can't buy Daniel Smith in five milliliter tubes. Oh, Sandra worked in a shut it. Right on, Sandra. <laughs> hey, Sherlock. Sherlock, listen, I almost have a voice. So yeah, we'll play with these and see what happens. But don't you think it'll make a beautiful page for a journal when all the paint's used up and smeared around? <gasps> Joe, you are? I want to see pictures of your watercolor artistry. I just mess around. Oh, cool, Laura, no problem. I just, I can, I can take it down. I just wanted you to know that it was there. We're going to be doing an inventory this week and reminding people if they have orders and taking them down if they already got them and all that good stuff. Oh boy, Joe. Oh, Jennifer, yeah, we were just talking about that. That's funny. They had a bigger one too. It was like all the colors, but it was expensive. It was $29 or $35 or something. <laughs> Elizabeth putting her foot down. Well, why wouldn't you want Hello Kitty mild liners? What are mild liners? Aaron Costner, it's almost your birthday. Somebody else has a birthday coming up. Everybody here is a goof, Mindy. That's why we love each other. All you little chickens. Oh, Natasha, that is just a crapshoot. You can find them at the thrift store sometimes. Sometimes you find them at flea markets. Hey, Babsy, what's up me? Well, I said hi, but you what, sweetie? Oh, you have a birthday coming up. Hello forgot already. When's your birthday, honey? Margie, you are lying. Laura's June 12th. I knew that. <laughs> Thank you, Laura. Yes, Babsy. When is your birthday? <laughs> Another trip around the sun. That's right. That's my favorite song, Christy. Yeah, they can be spendy, Natasha. That's true. You could try a Sherwin-Williams or something. Go in and see what they do when they're out of date. Laura, don't even start Margie and her food. Still waiting for Babsy's birthday. Did I miss it? Stuff's flying by, you guys. Yeah, Natasha, it's crazy. Are you talking about fabric samples or wallpaper samples? <laughs> That's right, Christina. And our Debbie Long contacted Home Depot and asked if it was all right to take the paint chips for crafting. And they said, absolutely.
Sherlock, who's May 2nd? Did I miss it? Is that Babsy's? Ah, <gasps> Babsy, you're on Nom Nom's birthday. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Sorry. Well, happy birthday almost. If I were more, you know, organized, I'd send out birthday cards. Did you too? You did too, Dorinda? That's right, Christina. You can take in just a regular shopping bag. Fill it up. <coughs> Sorry, guys. All right, so let's move the painting stuff slightly to the side. Yes, Susan is March 25th, Laura. I meant to say that and I forgot. Laura, do you have wallpaper books too? That's right. TP Nom's car. Oh, thanks, Darla. I know, huh? It's getting close. Oh, Susan, it's okay. You can still be sneaky just for entertainment purpose. Jennifer, you're an August baby and Dorinda's a September baby. You're June 1st, right, Sherlock? Hey, Cynthia. Your order went out today, honey, honey. So did yours, Joe. I did freeze all the cooties off of it. I'm happy to report. I have to write these things down, you guys. A new Cheryl. Dorinda, when are you? I'm writing things now. Nikki's October 1st. That would be a good idea, Michelle. And Barbara Kelly is home now. Yep, I froze those puppies right off there, Joe. <coughs> Christy, that's funny. Ah, oh, the thrill is gone. Cynthia, you're May 2nd also. Happy birthday. 60 is awesome. And that is Mark's birthday and Babsy's birthday. Oh, Dorinda, thank you. I'm glad that you like them. Still writing down birthdays, guys. You're right, though. I should stop this and we should, um, we should put it in the... Um, rack list. I think we talked about that before I got sick, huh? It does, Jennifer. Good to know. <coughs> I'm sorry, guys. Nikki, old baby. Hey, Luce, welcome. Awesome, Michelle. Did you like 49? Is that you just picked it to stay at? Oh, I should probably put something interesting up here. Well, let's see what sweet Elizabeth sent me without putting addresses here on the screen. I just opened the end. I have not, um, I have not peeked yet, Elizabeth. I did get her permission to do this on on live. Yeah, actually, I'm I'm getting out the post-it note. <gasps> My post-it notes are gone. <clears throat> Dorinda, thank you. I know it's just it's annoying, but there's no getting around it. Vicky, that makes you September, right? Sherlock, you look like you're 12. So shut it. All right, I got to get out more post-it notes because mine disappeared. I'm telling you, you take your eyes off stuff for just a minute. Um, I'm putting a note down. Oh, that's not a pencil. It's a paintbrush. <laughs> I'm writing a note. Hey, it's something fabulous that you sent to me and it was exciting. <gasps> Vicki, I believe Christy just jumped directly down your neck. Vicki, are you a member of our group on, on Facebook? <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, 
So anyone who's not, go join us on Facebook, join the group, and we will get a um, birthday list up. Natasha, it's Recreations by Brooke on Facebook. <laughs> I said it once by mistake, Christy, Facebook, and now it's a joke. That's what we call it. I own Facebook. <laughs> Awesome, Susan. I'm turning 54. Oh, Lord. I don't like saying that out loud. That was sneaky. All right. So B-Day list on group. I think we did before I got sick. I think we talked about this. So I'm putting a note to myself. And if you guys aren't a member of our group, the link is down below go on over and I have a sneaking suspicion that you'll get accepted into the group. Oh, thanks, Nikki. I don't act my age. That's for sure. Right. And now it's nose blowing time for the next part of our show. I think it's just fine, Laura. <laughs> no, I don't act my age. <laughs> Do you really? Nice, Joe. <coughs> awesome, Vicky. One is the page. We started out with a page, and then these people held me hostage and made me make a group, and that one's private. It's a closed group, um, so you have to ask to join it. But I didn't want to take the page down and have people not be able to find us. Oh my gosh, Christina, you're so funny. <laughs> yeah, I don't either, Dorinda. No idea. Christina, how old is your son? I know this, but I forget. Yeah, Joe, numbers don't matter. Who cares? Now, I, um, Cynthia and Vicky, I know it's confusing because they're two two different places, but um, as I said, I didn't. I just didn't want to. Oh my goodness, Elizabeth! No, you didn't. I didn't want to take the page down and make people think that we just disappeared. But the group is private, so that or closed or whatever. So um, you know, when we're posting pages and stuff, not the whole world can see it. You see. I got the bag book. <laughs> sure, Christy, sign me up. Elizabeth, I can't believe you. I'm going to cry. Just a little something. Will the Jaeger make me feel better, Christy? Because that sounds fun. Oh, you guys, I've been watching Elizabeth make this and coveting it in my deepest of hearts. Or one just like this, either way. Yeah, Dorinda, kind of. Um, awesome, Vicky. Thanks. Erin, this is me on DayQuil. My sinuses are cleaner than they've been. I cannot believe that you sent me this. Oh, you guys. <gasps> Elizabeth. Now it's not, right? This is right side up. The lag is not helpful. I love it too, Sherlock. Look at this. <gasps> You guys, look at all this deliciousness. Elizabeth, it's upside down, you moron. <coughs> I can't believe you sent me this. Look at how beautiful. Oh, it's got my little bee. Made with a beautiful bath and our lush bag, which I love. And I'm guessing it smells delicious, but. We've already established, oh, we've already established my nose is broken. And I got one of the mandalas. Oh, I don't know yet, Christy. I'm still looking at its lovely jumbliness. Oh, you guys, Elizabeth crocheted this. Can you even stand how gorgeous it is? I know, Christina, right? My list keeps going and going. Oh. It is. It's like a hot pad. 
I'm so in love with it. Love this. I'm going to put my face on it. I just did. I bet this is what your house smells like, Elizabeth. There's a, there's a, not a smell, but you know what I mean? How people's houses smell like things. Even my broken snout can smell it. Oh, I know, Vicky, isn't it gorgeous? Elizabeth taught herself. And I wish the colors were as vibrant on YouTube as they are in real life. I did not sit on it. Oh, you mean Elle sat on it? Cool. Then it has Elle's butt print, and that makes me happy. Yes, thank you. That's right. An aroma. That sounds a lot better. Elle did. <laughs> Elizabeth, thank you so much. In love with that. That's right, Christy. Oh, so now this. It looks like it is bound with this ribbon, you guys. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much I'm a butt sniffer. It's part of my charm. You know, Joe. What are you going to do? Oh, so this is a pocket on top, Elizabeth says. There's a secret pocket, you guys. Oh, it's attached. It's not that secret. Yes, there's a bee on the flower. Oh my gosh. This is like the best birthday present ever, Elizabeth. It's a pocket. It's going to have to go in my journal. My creative journal has taken a hit, what with the illness. I don't really know, Christy. Who, who could tell? Nope, it's the letter B. Isn't it beautiful? Oh my gosh, Elizabeth. <laughs> That's right, Dorinda. Once I ripped it off. Oh, look at the fabric. And there's a secret pocket in there with goodies. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Elizabeth scanned the mandala and made a note card out of it. Oh, not a note card. Just scan. Oh, no. This is her melted. Her melted. Help me, what is this call? I did too, Laura. I know, Susan, isn't that nice that dogs have that way of saying, hey, how the hell are you? Oh, Christy, how do you know they're not right in the head? <laughs> oh my gosh. What a blessing it would be if we could open and shut our ears as easily as we do our eyes. Yeah, Betty wasn't wrong, Susan. Oh my gosh. My loathings are simple. Stupidity, oppression, crime, cruelty, and soft music. <laughs> Melted granny, thank you, Elle. Oh my gosh. Hey, Kathy, welcome. We are looking, we are celebrating the fact that I did not die and um, am on the upswing from the terrible plague, <coughs> sort of, excuse me, and um, going through the, oh, oh my gosh, this delicious bag of goodness, book of goodness that Elizabeth sent me. Look, you guys, she sent me one of her fabric tapes. <coughs> I like all the noses. I like that a lot, Christy. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at all those tiny, tiny crochet stitches. And the colors are gorgeous. Elizabeth, I have to start my new creative journal for May and June. And um, I'm seeing a lot of this stuff going in there. <coughs> I have a little note. Oh, <laughs> now I know what you meant, Elizabeth. <clears throat> A lovely note. Thank you, honey. Hey, Penny, thank you. Uh-oh, people were getting wet packages. Stupid post office. I know, Michelle, isn't it? And so, you guys, it's like a flowish journal with all these beautiful embellishments and pockets 
and black and whites and colors and glossy and ah. Uh, <coughs> and because Elizabeth bound it with the ribbon, I can use all the yumminess in my creative journal. Oh. Look at this. Elizabeth, is this Kool-Aid? Because the colors are beautiful. Oh, somebody else's junk envelopes. That's always fun. And car oh, chickens, chickens and roosters. Yay. And they're matte. These are the best. Well, semi-gloss. Creative child games, my favorite, because I'm a creative child. <coughs> Kathy, what did Aaron get that you had to count? I know, Michelle, when we're done looking at it, you know I'll be going back in. <gasps> These are labels, you guys. Elizabeth the Scanning Maniac made a beautiful collage, scanned it, and printed it on stickers. It's food coloring. Oh, it was your wine. A little card Bordeaux. <laughs> Yay, Aaron. Kathy, you know that Aaron knows all the trivia and it's quite possibly cheating. These are beautiful. Oh, yes, when I'm done playing with it with you guys, you know I'll spend a ton of time going back through it, Michelle. Beautiful. The Moron, my favorite. And Elizabeth, it is so tightly bound. Don't copycat. Oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness. Fun. I love this paper, and it looks like it's going to be seriously fun. Hey, Kazia. I'm sorry I missed you the other day, honey. I got your message, but I honestly have not watched a video or a live in like 10 days, nine days. Hi, Julia. Welcome. We are looking at beautiful things. Oh, things that Elizabeth sent me. Oh, you guys, look at that. <coughs> Thank you, Michelle. Thanks for stopping by, honey. I'm going to probably go on live again tomorrow and do some crafting. Doesn't look like we're going to get far in painting today. Michelle, do you have any requests for May stickers? Love this, Elizabeth. Love, love, love. Love this. Susan, I love that Bambi book. I covet it. All these fun embellishments and... I want a free snow cone. Elizabeth gave up her free snow cone. This is super cool, Elizabeth. Is it clothing? A clothing tag? I love it. I love all your little envelopes and page envelopes. And All right, Michelle, do you have any requests for words to go on them? I've got the dates done, but I need to fill out the the fillers, the extras. Okay, I love this. I love these colors. Yes, Elizabeth is so, so, so talented. Oh, look how cool that is. Forever 21. I didn't know they had cool tags like that. My kids go there. <coughs> all of it, all of it. Wow. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right, Michelle, will do. Look for them tomorrow evening. I'm going to get them up by tomorrow if it kills me. And I'm sorry they're late. Love you. Thank you for coming. Elizabeth is a most colorful, creative creature. Elizabeth, these... Oh, my gosh. I love this color. Now I'm just going to have to pick out what book to make my journal out of. And I have like all the fillings for it right here. Oh, look at this, you guys. Oh, double pocket. Your folds are so precise. Diane, my love, how are you feeling? Sweet Diane and sweet Laura, laughing dogs, um, both had the same plague that I did at the same time. 
and I think we're both coming out, or all three of us are coming out of it now. Oh, oh, German, must be German. So cool. Diane, you got your invoice for the road show and your hotel booking information is on there. So you are all set, my friend. Cannot wait to meet you. All of you guys getting so excited and Texas is set. I will be addressing that later this evening when we're done here. So here's the ribbon, you guys. It's been wrapped around, Elizabeth wrapped it around several times to bind it in. I don't know, Joe, I'm pretty sure Laura Vasquez sent it to me, but she wasn't kidding. She also sent me happy mail and it's beautiful. Oh, good, Diane, I meant to send you a text and um, yeah, I've just lost track of everything as you know. Me too, Diane. <laughs> and Penny was sick too, yes. Like that, Diane. Does it sound familiar? I hope that you're on the upswing too, Penny. Is today the first day that you're feeling better, Diane? My mouth is so dry. More water. Water is good. Oh, more tags. More tags. Yeah, it's just awful. And I saw that Laura said it was the first time that she'd been out in over a week today. <gasps> My backside's getting a boost from Elizabeth, you guys. Excellent, Diane. Well, you take it easy. We are all taking it easy this week. Elizabeth, this is too generous. Look at these. How did you do these, Elizabeth? I'm thinking these are oxides. A booty boost. Oh, push-up shorts. I'm getting them. They are hysterical. But lift shorts. I'm getting these. I don't know where, but I'm going to. Shake that booty. <laughs> Do you still, Penny? Uh, isn't she, Elizabeth? This is so cool. And more oxides. And more oxides. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh, oh, check this out, you guys. Look at that. Uh, but I love you too. <laughs> They're so cool. So cool, Elizabeth. And you know how much I love playing with clothing tags. Elizabeth, this cannot be the pads. Do you have re-inkers? Is this it? That's right, Dorinda, see? One sag problem alleviated. Gonna have the butt of a 23-year-old with my new butt-lifting shorts. That's terrifying, isn't it? And look at this, another gorgeous tag. Oh, Elizabeth, I cannot tell you. Oh, that's right, shaving foam. Yes, sick children and sad children. Oh my gosh, that came out beautifully. Oh, did you do another video on this recently, Elizabeth? I may have missed it. <coughs> Excuse me. Hello, Debbie, my love. I was taking your name in vain earlier. I don't remember why, but I was in a nice way. You guys, why was I talking about Debbie? Look at this tag, you guys. Old school Dymo puncher thingy. Oh, so beautiful. Love the ribbon. Love the colors. Love this paper that the little ta uh, pocket page is folded out of. I have missed you too, Debbie. It was so nice having a nice long chat with you. This is a beautiful um, faux flow bag book that Elizabeth made for me. She said just a little something and it turns out to be the mother load of deliciousness. Food coloring dyed paper, but lifting shorts, that's right. 
That's right, everyone, bring your butt lifting shorts to the retreat. Penny, are you able to come to the retreat? Look at this, oh, beautiful colors, beautiful. And they come out so differently than ours. It's like everyone's papers, just like coffee dyed papers, they all come out differently and it's so fun to have different ones. Hey Eve, welcome. I am on the upswing, Eve. I'm annoying with my coughing and sniffling and it's now nose blowing time. but I feel um, so much better. Thank you. Diane, you have a shapely backside, silly. You're a beautiful woman. <laughs> Dorinda, you guys are so silly. That would be so awesome, Penny. Oh, oh, recipe cards. Oh my gosh, these are so 70s. Look at that. I love artichokes. That's what the aphids ate last year, those dirty rats. They ate, I tried to grow artichokes, and the aphids ate them down to like little stumps in three days. Thank you, Eve. No butt at all syndrome. <laughs> I love these. And look at the back of this security envelope. I've never seen one like that. <laughs> Me too, Debbie. That's right. More of us to love. <laughs> Dorinda, you're so kind to share. A double pocket with beautiful oranges and pinks. Look at the tiny little um, collage down there. I love these colors. I know, Aaron, I say so too. Or sick your ladybug pack on them. Look how beautiful these tags are, you guys. These are from um, Elizabeth, Debbie. It's this beautiful faux flow bag envelope journal. Help me, Elizabeth. Full of delicious beautiness. Joe, yeah, apparently no. You can't grow artichokes in Maine because the aphids ate them. Another fabulous fun pocket. Oh, Elizabeth, photocopy of your favorite fabric. I'm almost out of this. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Sorry. Debbie, I was just talking. Oh, that's gorgeous. I was just talking about the, pat the fact that I need to make a new creative journal for May and, A uh, May and April. Or May and June, if I'm going chronologically. Wait, I've missed something. Patrick, is Eve your son? The, the chat's flying, you guys. The chat's a flying. So gorgeous. And these pages that you made the pockets out of, Elizabeth, I love. Ew. It is a portable bit box and I adore it, Elizabeth. Oh, Eve, I'm so sorry. More sickly? I hope not. That's right. I know, Nikki, it's, it, the chat is flying. And I can hardly tear my eyes off all of this beautiness. I love these pages, Elizabeth. A little bowl of melted butter? What are we setting that out for? I know, Diane, right? You guys, if I'm missing stuff, I'm sorry. Still not, maybe, I might not be that sharp yet. And there's a whole lot of Dayquil on board. Oh, Eve, because it's crazy time because you're across the pond. So this must be a strange time for you, late. I'm glad that he likes to be part of this lovely group. I love you guys so much. Sandra, quit torturing people. Oh, well, no, they didn't need it, Susan, because they ate it plain. <laughs> yep, Diane. I hear you. 
No, not really, Nikki. Well, yeah, like 20 years ago, I was really sharp. I'm okay with it, though. I'm an older lady now. Oh, Eve, that's not so late. But he should be asleep. 10.45 for Nikki. Are you in your jammies, Nikki? Look at that. Oh, oh my gosh, look at that. I love the blossoms when they when it blooms like that. These are beautiful. I'm really not, Nikki. I'm a spring chicken. I'm starting to feel like a spring chicken again. I felt 150 last year. <gasps> what is this? Elizabeth, what is this? It's paper with handwriting. And Russian stuff, but I want to go see the other half. Where was the other half of this? This is going to involve dissecting. I'm taking it out. Hold on, guys. We're whipping it out. Julie, you're back. Did you drive home? <laughs> oh, Nan, you're at work. I got out of my jammies today just because I had to go out and about. <gasps> Look at this. Elizabeth, is this your handwriting? I love it. I love it. I love it. It's like that. Um, oh, what kind of paper is this? <coughs> it's awesome. Rack of lamb, sheep meat, lamb chops. I love this. 1045 for you too, Julia. What time? Oh, it's 545. Love this. Oh, and you parted with some of your Molly and Rex note paper. It is like newsprint, but a little finer, Carla and Elizabeth. Hey, Maddie, welcome. Oh, Susan, tell them that, that you can't help it. Hi, Maddie and Madison, if you're here. Just hit disconnect, man. Love it, love it, love it. Maps. Oh, look at that, you guys. Yeah, you're going to be seeing all of this in my creative journal. <coughs> Russian text. Beautiful. Love the size. Some of her treasured Molly and Rex notepads. Oh, look at that, you guys. Hi, honey. <coughs> I'm sorry. Madison, what are you, you and your mom up to? Beautiful, beautiful new, new to paper. So excited. Look at this. Oh, coin wrapper embellishment. Oh, love it. Is that on a paper clip, Elizabeth? It is. Elizabeth has a fabulous video on her channel. Well, Susan, I'd like to see that in writing. <coughs> that uh, union suits are not appropriate office attire. Even on casual Friday, this is a beautiful magazine page that I'm guessing might be Daphne's diary. <coughs> Hold on, water break, you guys. And the back of the whole kit and caboodle. Oh my gosh, Elizabeth, thank you. Thank you. Beyond thank you. Oh, yeah. If you get a, a zippered pair, that makes them much more um, professional. Huh. Well, Natasha, that's different. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Maddie, I know I sound so annoying with the cough and the runny nose. I feel so much better. Today is the first day in nine days that I feel like a human. I know, Nikki, this is my portable bag to go with my uh, creative journal that I have to make. Oh, something in the back pocket. I missed something. Oh, no. Oh. <coughs> oh, you guys. Oh, you guys. Ruffles, fabric ruffles. Fabric ruffles. Nothing is better than other people's fabric bits. 
<coughs> Isn't it wonderful, Natasha? It is so good. Yeah, Sandra, I'm thinking maybe uh, maybe we're going to wrap it up because I think maybe I've yacked enough. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at all the fabric ruffles. In love, I have to go find the book. <coughs> Sorry. Hey, Valerie, welcome. I have to find the book that we're going to turn into a journal. Love it. I love bits and bobs. And it has its own little handle to go around with me. Genius, Elizabeth. Genius. I know. Do you guys want to make the creative journal with me? Maybe I'll uh, I'll pick pick out some of the options. I love that they're in there. <coughs> I'll pick out some of the options for books that I'm going to use, and you guys can help me. I know, Diane. I hate hot lemon honey tea. Yep, it is. It's getting irritated. So I still didn't open um, the beautiful happy mail from Laura <coughs> or the beautiful happy mail from Sweet Tammy and OKC. And um, yeah, I want to I want to do that, but I don't think I'm going to do it now. So I'm going to say thank you to the everyone that sent me delicious goodies. Elizabeth, I can't thank you enough. I will save the Daniel Smith to play with with you guys. And I'm going off to finish up our May stickers. <coughs> I do. I hate. I like lemon cookies and lemon cake. That's about it. And I'm not a huge fan. I, honey's okay. <coughs> Haven't I been blessed, Debbie? You guys are so good to me. I know, Sandra. What I will drink is um, some more beef broth, beef bouillon. I don't know why, but it makes me feel so much better. And drinking more water. I know, we're just all sickies. So these are some of the flowers that will be in the, the May stickers. Some of them didn't make the cut, but we'll have some lilacs and some lavender. And the tulips didn't work out the way I'd hoped, so I'll probably redo those. Yes, I need, oh, Julie, I am living on Theraflu. <laughs> yes, and Jaeger, stat. Oh, I could do that, Diane. I don't mind it by itself, although that sounds like a lot. <laughs> oh, I wish you could too, Kazia. Every size flowers. All right, Debbie. Does anyone have any requests for the extras? I think what I'm going to do is the um, flowers are going to have the, the days of the week on them. And um, I'm going to do little banners with the dates. <coughs> oh, thanks, you guys. And then the flowers will come in different sizes without the days of the week. Julie, I like that a lot. I like the tiny words. That's fun. <coughs> so does anyone have any requests for words or anything? Thanks, you guys. Oh, this might be, this rose might be a contender. Well, it's actually a ramunculus, but I haven't done the pen in it yet, but that might be in the running. So now's the time to request words or what have you, because, um, I'm going to work on them tonight so that we can have them up tomorrow. And I'm so sorry that it's late, you guys. I had the best of intentions. Oh, thanks, you guys. All right. Well, I am coughing my face off, so I'm going to go ahead and, and shut her down. But um, I will, if you leave something in the comments, <coughs> I will check them in a little bit. Margie, shame on you. <laughs> Tattoo words. Okay. Awesome. Awesome, Natasha. <coughs> gotcha, Kasia. All right, you guys. I love you all. I'm going to go take honey and eat bouillon. Um, blooming words. All right.
and um, keep an eye out because I think I'll come back tomorrow. I love you guys so much and thank you for coming by and I will see you tomorrow. Night, everybody.